Kara looked down from her wall and saw a bird flying towards the hedge. I wonder where Chaffinch is going. She jumped down to ground level. How annoying! Chaffinch has flown away again, but I am sure he was in the middle of that pattern of hedges. I'm going to check it out. Oh, there's a person here before me. What's that they've got in their hand? It seems to be something that makes the robot walk. I bet he's going to the middle of that pattern of hedges. I'll follow him. <laughs> oh, I've lost him. I've been watching you from up high. There's a robot drone in the sky flying round and guiding that walking robot through the maze. Do you want me to tell you which way to go to fly round and then give you instructions to follow? No, thank you, Jackdaw. I don't follow instructions. I'm a curious cat. Oh, what's that wriggling over there? I'm following that. Oh, look, Jackdaw. These are just perfect. What are they? They're totally round, like the universe. They are Chaffinch's eggs. Pretty soon, they will crack open and each one will have a new baby bird and it will poke its head through and call out for food. Chaffinch will be busy then. Oh, it's lovely. I'm going to creep away so as not to disturb them. It was good to be curious. Humans have pushy robots to make things move along. And then they have flying robots to watch over things. And clever dick robots to solve puzzles. Cats have mysteries to marvel at, adventures to have, and friends to make. I'm glad you decided to be a cat rather than follow the robot. So Kara gazed up at the sky and marvelled at the beautiful bird flying past. And she decided she was going to carry on being curious. Thank you for watching. These were pictures painted for the Armchair Painting Group. Tune in again for some more adventures of Cara the Curious Cat.